Just walk me through what's this feeling? What's the sensation that's about your first year program, first time state champion? What's this like? Oh, it's crazy. I mean, we we knew we could do it from the start. I mean, we put in so much time and work um, just from the start of just when we met each other in section seven. Um, I mean, we just put in work, and we knew we knew where we could go, and we really we proved that to, to everybody uh, who doubted us. Yeah. You know, the last month of the se regular season, you know, you guys were winning by by large margins, and you know, three close games here that you guys were able to pull out. You know, what's it say about the resilience that you were able to still win those close games? You know, it doesn't. I I think it doesn't really matter how many we beat them by, as long as we win. And we uh, we showed grit, and you know, we were just we were just one, tougher. Baby, one. Right? The tougher team wins. <laughs> Walk me through, I mean, like I said, doubters. I mean, who was doubting you guys? Well, what, what kind of the outside noise you hear Jack was telling about people saying, like, oh, they won in California, that doesn't mean they can win here. Like, what was the... I mean, I just, we just heard a bunch of stuff from SIC teams, just people all around Idaho just saying, you know, first year program, like, they're not going to do much. And we took that personally. We wanted to show people what we could do and how we were going to do it, and we did tonight. And where did... How good does it feel to show them wrong? Oh, it feels great. I'll tell you that. It feels great. Where did this belief come from? Because like you said, first year program, no experience. I mean, what allowed you guys to believe you guys could win the state title. I mean, just the guys, really. Like, I just we really had that chemistry from the start. I mean, I, I keep saying that because you know it's true. Like, we just we trust each other. I mean, we move the ball well. We're not selfish, and you know the results show. I mean, we really play as a team. And I mean, no first year program and boys. I mean, in recent memory, I should say, has ever done this. What's it mean for you to be a part of this and make history tonight? I mean, it just it feels amazing. Like my heart is still uh, racing. It just it's it's crazy. I mean, we knew we could do it. We really did. How cool is it going to be next year to you know be playing on your home court, look up, see that banner, and say, "Yep, that's ours." Oh, it's awesome because we really. We really did history really tonight. Um, I mean, and we're not done. That's all I want to say. I mean, we're going back to back next year, but we're going to be ready next year as well. What does this mean for the school? Like, is it it's brand new? You don't have any tradition in anything, any sports, uh, to now bring that back. What does that mean for the school? I mean, we're going to set an example for our future generations and future people at Hawaii to follow. I mean, really setting the, the ground base for everybody to follow, and, you know, we're going to keep that up. What changed in the fourth quarter? That's why I thought you guys really had some separation. You had some big shots there. What changed for you guys to finally get some separation in that fourth? Uh, we stayed together, and we played much better defense in the fourth quarter. Um, uh, we didn't take uh, bad shots in the fourth quarter. You know, we wanted to get on the rim, uh, stop shooting less threes because our three-point percentage wasn't very well. Um, so we wanted to get to the rim, pass the ball, uh, play some lockdown defense, and you know, we were able to do that. And speaking of, I mean, speaking of the defense, I thought you guys did a great job limiting their perimeter shooting. I mean, how big of an emphasis was that to limit their three ball? I mean, they're, they're fantastic three-point shooters. Um, there's no lie about that. So we wanted to just, you know, kind of make them drive on us because we have really good help. So. Uh, we didn't want them to shoot the threes, you know, we were chasing them down, so, and we were able to, uh, we were able to do that. What can you say about Jack? I mean, going to leave senior year, and what can you say about him and what he's kind of meant this first year? I mean, Jack was a great leader. Uh, he really, he really showed us the way. Um, you know, it's going to be a big loss losing him next year, but uh, we're going to have some people step up. I'm going to really step up to be a leader. Uh, but yeah, this is my first year. And we're, like I said, we're coming back next year. Yeah, he's obviously done a lot of things for you guys all year, but tonight he takes three shots, you know, which is just, and guys like Barrett and, we, we both, and Cameron hit a big three. What's the show about this team that you can win on a night win? Jack? I mean, everybody knows the rule. I mean, Jack, even though he takes the less shots, I mean, he's a fantastic passer. He's able to see the floor well. And then Barrett and Cam, I mean, they, they do their job when, it's, when the time is right. And I mean, it's, it's awesome. Our team really flows. What can you say about the job Andy's done? I mean, this is a second title with a different team. I mean, yeah. what can you say about him? No, it, Coach, it, Coach has done a fantastic job. Um, just from the start, I mean, he's really helped us. He's showed us how to do everything correctly. I mean, he's pushed us, and that's what's really helped us a lot. And, you know, I just, he's, he's a fantastic coach, and I can't wait to play under him next year. Last thing for me, I mean, you're only a sophomore, Liam. You got a young team. You feel like this is just a start for you guys? Oh, this is for sure just a start. Like I said, we're coming back next year. It's not going to stop. All right, congratulations, man. Thank you. Thank you.